and we'll have that typically sit in little groups so you're able to... It's amazing to obviously get to come and see the kids and just spend some time with uh, people in the community, so it's really special. I don't know how good my, draw <laughs> my drawing skills are as good as yours. Yeah, I think it's just amazing, obviously, to tell kids it's okay to feel things and speak to people about things. So I think it's obviously amazing that they're starting these types of initiatives and that obviously we can come in here as a good role model or positive influence to kind of reiterate those, uh, the things that they're learning about. It was nice to be here and meet all the kids. Uh, it's an important thing to speak about. Uh, and. It's not always easy, um, but you need to learn to accept your feelings and talk about them. And um, I'm, talk I'm talking a lot to, to people around me, like my family and my friends, uh, and it helps me a lot. I get a lot of support from them, so that helps me a lot. Football's always ups and downs, and I think it's kind of about riding those ups and downs. And like I said, talking to the people that you have around you to support you, and I think it's just about you learn to deal with your emotions as you mature, so obviously if you start earlier, it's, I think it's a great advantage for them. It's very important and it's nice that we can be here to, to support them a little bit and help them on, on that journey. Yeah, I think it's so great and obviously seeing all the kids, like I think they all rose their hands that they love playing football or play football and support Everton and everything. So I think it's amazing to be able to, yeah, like you said, connect with the kids, the next generation and obviously connect with the community because the club means so much to them.